Hey, what is up heroes and welcome back to more Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu. Last episode, we made our way through Victory Road, got the Indigo Plateau and we are now ready to take on the Elite Four. However, we are not doing that just yet. Next few episodes, we'll be capturing some legendary Pokemon and we're starting off with Moltres, which you can find in Victory Road. So we're going to head from the back because it's just easier this way. Go from the back and do you remember what we saw Officer Jenny last episode? Well, just past her, down the ladder, should lead us to Moltres. Right, so... Let's avoid that dude, and we'll go up here. Probably a good idea to pop a repel, but to be honest, we don't really need to. So we can just run around the Pokemon. He says, and then <laughs> the grappler pops up. So we're going to run away from it, because we don't need to get you just yet. I have 250 Ultra Balls. Hopefully that's enough. <laughs> we'll see soon enough. Uh, so if we go around here, and we go up this ladder and then we want to go round here we'll see officer Jenny there she is sup gonna run past her and go down this ladder okay so I follow this path oh miss an item and we got PP max sweet And there it is. Oh my goodness, Moltres just chilling there. So I save the game. Make sure you save the game before you encounter any legendary Pokemon, in case you mess up. So, wait, what does Pikachu want to do in front of Moltres? Oh, Pikachu, you scared of Moltres. It's fine, it's fine. Sup. Here we go! You gotta battle Moltres before you can uh, capture it. Let's go, Pikachu. And we have five minutes to do this, so it should be really easy, just Thunderbolt. Oh, what? I thought I healed up! Oops, I did not heal up, but it's fine. <laughs> we just one shot Moltres. <laughs> oh, brilliant. Okay, now we can capture it. Right, so bag. We got some pretty good berries. Go for a golden res. Alright, time this round. We're trying to get excellent. Oh, you just have to move at the last second. Okay. Wait for it. When he comes back. That did not go the way I was hoping it would go, but okay. Alright. Go for another golden round. Not gonna use my master ball, saving that for uh for Mewtwo. Stop moving! Oh, I went over its head. Okay, that banged it in the head. <laughs> Come on! No, oh, I thought we had it then. Alright. Another golden raz. Oh, dude, if it didn't move a little bit, I think we could have got that great at least. Alright, I'm going to save my berries for later on. I just want to see if we can get any luck with some normal Ultra Balls. Oh, go on. Ah, oh, dude, thought we had it. It's so hard to try to get like a great or an excellent or even a nice. I think if we get excellent, we catch it. Okay, that's fine. Oh, I'll stop moving the last second. Maybe I should use the uh, Nabab just to stop it moving. Let's try that. Got a golden one as well. Okay, still moves. For it. That was nowhere near. Okay, got a nice. Hey, we got it! 
We got Moltres! The first legendary Pokemon is down. Ah, oh, brilliant. Sweet. Add that to the Pokedex. Very good. Legendary bird Pokemon. As it flaps its flaming wings, even the night sky will turn red. Excellent. What does Pikachu want to say about catching Moltres? Happy about it? Sparky is staring at the Pokeball you just used. Okay, didn't get to read the rest of that, just went, but... Yeah! Alright, so let's get out of here. And we'll go check out this Moltres. We have plenty of escape ropes. Got six, so let's go use that. See, I thought Moltres was going to be a lot more harder to catch than that. If I'm honest. <laughs> that was... Didn't take too long, did it? Not long at all. Alright. Up to the good plateau. I need to heal up. I could have sworn I healed up after doing a bit of grinding, but I didn't. Which is fine. Alright. Fully healed. Oh, yeah. Oh, I was thinking I need to run back to the Pokemon box just to check it out, but... This game doesn't have a box, does it? <laughs> oh, okay. Right. Well, it has a box, but not a computer box. Right. Moltres, let's check you out. Level 50. Victory Rose, uh, takes plenty of... Psystats? Okay, uh... Docile... Got Air Slash, Flame for Agility, and Heat Wave. Not bad at all. CP 2157. Nice. And I'm pretty sure, 100% actually, um, someone said you can shiny hunt pretty much every Pokemon in this game, but the um, Pikachu and Eevee starters, which is kind of crazy. You can even shiny hunt like trade Pokemon. If you guys want to know what a shiny Moltres looks like, I can quickly show you. It's not... It's not great, if I'm honest. <laughs> Pikachu doing a little dance. Like, it's... I think it's better than Articuno and Zapdos. Because Zapdos looks no different at all, and then Articuno just... Articuno is quite nice, actually. It's, it's like a lighter blue, but... It's... Moltres is the most different shiny looking shiny. You can obviously tell if it is shiny or not, but... It... It just looks like a... <laughs> it looks like a chicken. <laughs> Like a raw chicken. Right. Let's go. I think it was in park one. Let's go check it out. Oh no, not bring Pokemon. Uh and to go park. Park one. Still many, many more Pokemon I need to capture on this go park to uh, complete the Pokedex. But I'll be doing that mostly off screen and then the Pokemon we need to capture in game. That'll be the like, last video of just catching the last Pokemon, completing the decks, and then getting the shiny charm. Right, shiny Moltres, where you at? Is it in here? Got the shiny starters there. Maybe Go Park too, because I might have had it favorited. I kind of wish you could like just zoom out a little bit. Yeah, it's gonna be Go Park too. Well, you can zoom. It's not that much of a zoom to be honest. I was kind of hoping you can see the whole park area, but let's go park two. Alright, go park two. Gotta show you guys the shiny Moltres. Alright, where is that? There's Mewtwo. Lots of Mewtwo's. A hat over here. There it is. Look at it. <laughs> uh, this CP is a bit lower than the last one. Should we try and uh, get this bad boy? Get that shiny Moltres, dude. Oh, dude, I honestly thought we were going to get a first ball then. That would have been so nice. Come on. Ah, okay. So we can also get a shiny Zapdos, but 
I don't think I, I don't think I traded transferred it over from my Go because I think my Shiny Zapdos is actually pretty good. But I never got a Shiny Articuno unfortunately because Shiny Articuno Day was horrible to me. I did like 19 raids, didn't get a Shiny. <laughs> well, I'm not too fast to be honest. I got plenty of Shinies and other legendaries. I got Shiny Koga. I got many Shiny Lugia. I got two Shiny Ho. -Oh. What else do they do? Apart from the birds, I can't remember what other shinies they did. I think it was just that. Hopefully they add like shiny Groudon or a Quasar at some point. I would love that. Come on, Ultras. Be a bro. Come on. Oh. Come on. Come on. So hard trying to get this dude. But yeah, we got like, the first Moltres in the what? Like, I think it was 10 or 11 balls. So it wasn't too difficult. And we got a golden Nabab. How did that. I suppose I just hit it, but. Get me wrong, but. Double attacking, great. I'm never gonna get excellent on Moltres. It's so hard. I think, like, this game is. Like, I got an excellent. <laughs> I think this game is so much harder to hit the Pokemon than it is in Pokemon Go. Oh, come on, man. And you moved. I honestly don't think we're about to capture this shiny Moltres. <laughs> I think of a time limit as well before the Pokemon runs away. Or well, sometimes it's just want to run away in general. Like, my girlfriend's got her game now, she was playing, I was watching her, she was on like a, a 10 Caterpie chain. And then, literally, she threw one ball at Caterpie, it broke out, then it ran away straight away. <laughs> it's like, okay, your chain's broken. Oh, so mean. I don't want to waste all my Ultra Balls trying to get this Moltres. If I can get it, it'll be brilliant, but... I've already got the main one, that's the most important bit. Sometimes you can throw the ball so high, it's like I don't. I can't get the feel right of how hard I need to throw that, like swing the Joy-Con. Throw in the direction, like I want that right. Right, swing right. T too far right. It's very, very hard. Like when you're like swiping on the phone on Pokemon Go, it's just a lot easier to kind of at least tell where it's going to go. Oh, I thought I had it then. I that was the one. Right, this next one, trust me. This is the one. Gonna get it. Oh my god. That, I honestly thought I had that. And that one. Also, I'm kind of curious, let me know how you guys throw the ball, like, in, um, on this game, because sometimes I prefer doing it, like, having the Joy-Con pointing down than doing, like, a, a swipe upwards, then throwing it up then down. Also, let me know in Pokemon Go, if you do curve balls, do you curve at the ball anti-clockwise or clockwise? Because, I look, for me, I do it anti-clockwise. No, I don't, I do it, hang on. Yeah, anti-clockwise. I see people doing it clockwise, and it just, to me, doesn't look right, and doesn't feel right, and I try it. Yeah, just anti-clockwise, like kind of swipe it towards the right, and I see people do it towards the left, and it just it feels so weird. Right, I'm going to try a normal Raz. Don't want to waste my berries, I want to save them for Arcuno and Zapdos, but... Let's see if we can get it now. Dude, I thought I had it. Moltres, you are a pain in the butt, man! I wish, like, as well... This game was like Pokemon Go, where if you encounter a shiny, like when you find shiny legendary Pokemon in Pokemon Go, it's a guaranteed capture. As long as you hit it with your allocated balls, it's it. Oh, what? Stop attacking Moltres. You're lucky I've got plenty of money left so I can buy some more balls. But. I feel like he doesn't even want to run away. There we go, we got him. Got the shiny Moltres. That was that was a lot of effort, man. <laughs> How long did that take to catch? 
I was only level 20 as well. Whew. Man, that was... Ooh, combo. Do you think, like... I wonder if this would work. Do you think if you transfer, like, I've got... Uh, like, 15 Zapdoses. If I transfer all 15 Zapdoses into this game, get the catch combo, then I go and chain, train, like, shiny, chain shiny hunt a Zapdos in the power plant, do you think I have a better chance of getting a shiny? I think you might, if you're on that little combo. That could be something to potentially think about if you want to start shiny hunting. But how long it took me to get that, <laughs> that Moltres, that shiny one? Uh, I don't know if I'd want to go through that every time. Right, so, next we are going to go and get Zapdos, I think. Zapdos. Actually, let's do Articuno next, because Articuno is at the Seafoam Islands, and I kind of want to go and explore that. And the Seafoam Islands are, secret technique, just down here. I pretty much cleared out Route 20. Like you can see in the little top right, that little area there. I've, been, I've cleared the girl next to the one on the right side, but I think I need to go a bit further to the right, get to the Seafoam Islands, and then we can go hunt Articuno, which is going to be super fun. But yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy. I'll catch you guys next time for catching Articuno. Peace.